Okay, so hi everyone again. I am doing an unboxing, unbagging video. Um, it's from a shop called Miss A, and most to all of their cosmetics are a dollar. And so if I spent $35, I got free shipping. And it was my first time trying them, so I figured let's give it a shot. Sorry for the angle. I should turn it this way, and it, but it's going to be opposite for me. Or not opposite, but just weird. So, let's get right in. You'll see that I didn't get a lot of makeup because I don't wear a lot of makeup. I also got accessories. And there it says, it's shopmissa.com. Just have fun is the, um, I can't think of the word. That'll come to me later. Seems like they package it really well. Check to make sure that I got everything. Not that noise. Oh. Sorry. There we go. They bubble wrapped it, and then like tissue paper wrapped it, and then another type of wrapping, which is good. on camera. So first we'll start out with this bag. This bag was a dollar and I thought it was going to be way smaller. Look how big it is. I don't think you can see everything. I'm sorry. But this is what I'm going to hold on my mask in, which you'll see in a second. So I got a little beauty blender. I think this was more than a dollar, like a dollar fifty-five or something. That's that, and I got some of their wipes, their makeup removing wipes. And then this was makeup. Let's slide it up this way. It's um, AOA Studio Perfect Finishing Pressing Press Powder. That's one makeup item. This is a mask brush. It's like a silicone head and you apply the mask to your face so you don't get all the, the stuff on your hands. Use this little brush. For a dollar, you couldn't beat it. You had to try it. Blotting papers. I got a little scrubby thing so when you're washing your face. Sorry, I keep looking over. Sorry, the light's in here really bad. I got another little beauty blender, really tiny and black. And then I got these two perfect uh, BB creams. And they're okay size for a dollar. You can't beat that. I'll try them out and see what they're like. And then the rest are all masks. I got hair masks and face masks. So, got a vitamin E one. Oh, this is a mask for your nails. I've never seen this, but I had to try it. Another hair mask. Jojo Ba oil. Talking that right? Tea tree. And then charcoal. One of these was a Korean mask set, and the other one was, I don't even remember what it was called, but it was 
with one of the sets and the other set. So all this stuff cost me $35. The mask alone, both sets for $10 each. There's a peach one, a bubble mask, anti-aging facial mask, uh, pomegranate, this must be the um, Korean one, rejuvenal, rejuvenal collagen mask, white rose, moisture green tea. Marina facial mask, vitamin C, hydrating mask, fresh aloe, lovely strawberry, electric Q10, and brightening Ama button. Ama, I don't know. Our button. The only thing I don't like about these masks, they're the shape of a face, like an actual face. I like the creams that you put on because you can control the product. It just seems like it's doing more, I think. But again, for $10 for 12 of these masks each, I'm going to need it. That's a pomegranate, green tea, anti redness. I need to use that one. Green tea, blueberry face mask, and a, oh, a pink lemonade one. Avocado, brightening, cooling cucumber, uh, collagen face mask, milk face mask, and sweet honey. And that's all of them. Go some more light. I'm not going to fit them all, but it will fit most of them. Turn this way. I'll do that with all of them. It's easier to see. Can't zip it up, but. enough face mask for a while. So, if you want to know more about this company, check out their website. I'm not sponsored by them or anything. I paid the $35. But the bag itself is really cute. I don't know. All this stuff looks good.